Hey, what's up you guys? It is Platform Tech, and today I wanted to show you guys pretty much how to, uh, well, this was requested, so I'm going to show you basically how to export your guys' um, videos from Final Cut, and that's just because like some people switched over and they don't know how to um, go ahead and share it because on here everything's just totally, totally different than a couple updates ago. So if you have your um, video ready to go, it's playing, it's working. Um, I'm doing this short clip, it's not anything for like the future or the previews. But if your sound is working and if you're um, continuating with this whole entire video, then you're going to want to go ahead and go into the show share destinations. And then you're going to want to head, going to want to go ahead and click Apple devices 720 or 1080 depending on how high you want to go but I'm just going to click 1080 go into settings and then from here the format you can share it like raw like raw footage for video and audio or you can go ahead and click Apple devices which will share properly through Apple devices but YouTube does not like this function so computer will be the way that we will be going faster encoding or better quality I will click faster encoding and then the resolution I can change whichever one I want so I'm gonna click 720 because a smaller resolution and when I click this I can go and open it with QuickTime Player, iTunes or other uh, applications of the sort but instead I'm gonna just click do nothing so I'm gonna click next and then showing the destinations all over the place I'm just gonna click Mega Man test video and then click share or save or whichever it said so right here where I'm like scrolling over with my mouse is where they have the um, cursor that shows how much it has been finalized or if I click hold click and hold command 9 the sharing option will be shown right here where it says processing and trans encoding um, Mega Man test video mp4 so YouTube loves mp4 thank you so much and it's a uh, really easy to uh, use between cross platforms such as Windows and Mac so when this is all done I'm gonna show you guys how to export in um, something higher than 1080 so I will be right back with that alright so after that we're gonna go ahead and jump into the Nexus 4k test this is a video that's coming up very very shortly I'm gonna do this video first and then send in the Nexus 4k test just because someone requested this video first but going ahead and um, showing you guys all these beautiful previews you can see that um, I'm testing out the 4k uh, resolution <laughs> and that's gonna be totally totally different than how um, 720 is going to be exported so if we go into um, share and we click that 1080 like we did before and we go into settings that's as far as we get 1080 so I mean you can go through the whole mumbo jumbo of going through all that but I'm gonna go ahead oops click the wrong one click the project settings but if you did not believe me with that being 4k 30 frames per second yeah <laughs> You can imagine that this is going to be huge. This is only 2 minutes and 30 seconds long. And the last video was 111 megabytes for, um, for I believe, about a minute and 30 seconds. So if I go ahead and click um, Export File, click Settings, go into Video and Audio, it gives me a 9.13 gigabyte estimate. And I can go into H.264 um, and it will <laughs> greatly reduce, but this is a two minute video being um, uploaded in a one gigabyte estimate. So it is super, super crazy how much um, 4K takes up, especially since this is just a phone. And this is, this is phone 4K. That's like comparing phone like 1080 to a, a true DSLR that shoots 1080. But, um,. This, that's why everything's just being tested out right now. But I can go ahead and click next, and this thing is going to kick up like a jet engine. I don't know if you guys can hear it right now from my mic, but this this is... 
I can hear it, but um, we're going to go ahead and save it in our destination. Click save. And then command 9. And then watch the sharing. Um, I was able to share the last video within 5 minutes. Not really a lot, but this one's probably going to take a lot more since it's an entire gigabyte large. And it's only 2 minutes. I've had uh, 2 gigabyte files before. But that was only when it was reaching 20, uh, full 1080, 20 minutes long text and video effects included. So this being a 4K 2 minute video, that's really, really not surprising. But um, I'm gonna go to, I'm gonna wanna go ahead and um, upload the said video to um, my YouTube channel. So when I get to that point in time I will go ahead and show you guys how to upload your YouTube video from um, from your device so I'll be right back all right so now that we go ahead and from the YouTube page we'll go ahead and click this little upload button right there and uh, click select files to upload and wait majestically so after waiting majestically you'll look for where you um, set the video to be pretty much set you know there's no other thing and um, we found that Mega Man test video see if it works all right yes it does so hopefully um, I changed the mic around to see how this works but I have not uploaded to this YouTube channel in such a long time so if you are a subscriber watching this I am so so sorry so I'm gonna go ahead we can name the title Mega Man if not, then I guess this is it, you guys. This has been Platform Tech, and I, if you guys need anything else that you guys want to be seen um, or requested, I am more than happy to go ahead and try it for you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.